taking this bike. What an absolute nugget. What an absolute unit. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another vloggy vlog. It's a beautiful day. It's a gorgeous day. And I'm out here cruising on my lovely 620. I just had to jump start the battery because I haven't ridden in about three weeks. And uh, yeah, this thing did not want to start. So I basically decided to take it out for a little cruise just to get some juice into it to see if I maybe killed another battery or if I can actually recharge this one, which I'll see. Um, and I gotta say, feeling a little cranky today, feeling a little under, so I'm hoping this cheers me up. I'm gonna just pretend like I'm a, a little child riding around on his little bicycle. I feel like a uh, I feel like that's gonna cheer me up. Maybe not. We'll figure it out. There we go. Somebody actually asked me to do a vlog uh, on the old 620 doing uh, some braking and all that. Uh, some methods about like uh, emergency braking with no ABS and versus uh, ABS and you know what like it's so interesting to me oh look by the way this is a pot bar hilarious um, it's so interesting to me how I started on one of these bikes and now I ride a bike with an ABS and uh, I don't feel like um, ABS is affecting my riding like a million, million much. You know? Oh, look at this, all this sand. This is a place, good place to dump it. Uh, but uh, I don't really feel like ABS is like saving my bacon or anything. So as far as like uh, tips, I'll give you like the usual generic bullshit that I spread with anybody. Thank you. Thank you. Um, is uh, you know, brake gentler. Brake gentler. Be easier. Allow more time. And you know, like you cannot slam on the brakes. I don't understand how people uh, slam on the brakes. You know what I mean? Like unless you want to skid front and back, don't ever skid. Don't ever slam on the brakes. So that's why it's kind of a uh, kind of like a, it's like a weird thing. I'm, I'm not really sure how I can help. Uh, I really want to. Plus, I'm a terrible teacher. So like me explaining anything is a. Uh, is odd. I also got to stop saying that I'm a terrible teacher because perhaps I'm a good teacher and I'm just uh, negative on myself. Who knows? Doesn't matter really, does it? But I'm just going to explore these quiet little areas. You know, I don't really feel like dealing with any sort of actual traffic or people or anyone. The real test will be when I park this baby, if it will start back up. It's funny, my fork feels terrible, my... everything feels terrible. This bike uh, is like leaking oil extra hard now. Still going, you know, but you could certainly f use some love. I'm not sure what's going on here, but these people are hiding or something? No idea what is happening. What the actual shit is going on here? Alright bro. 
What are you trying to do? Damn. <laughs> Madness. Did you see that shit? That was insane. Uh, so. But it's just like, it's a, it's a, I, I'm a bad teacher with uh, that. Oh, look at this thing. That thing is dope. In that respect, it's because of, uh, I treat my ABS bike and my non-ABS bike equally just because uh, I don't know any other way. Holy shit. Why is there there's so many trucks here and why are they moving so quick? It's like a, a real thing. Ooh, that's a dope truck, brother. I like it. Um, so there's that. There is that. Because this person is, uh, took their class on the bike with an ABS and I love this I don't know why I go down here there's literally nothing to see here it's like a dead end block silly because I do this little wall ride sometimes but this person uh, wants to get one of these after getting the license on the bike with ABS and truth be told it's like just do it just do it and make it gentle you know what I mean make it gentle You don't want to go too hard now. You should never, like, don't even worry about it. And the thing is, in the wetness, especially, in the, in the wetness, you got to be especially gentle. Not bad, not bad. I mean, at least you gun in it. At least you gunned it, so there's that. Oh, now it's fucking idling all right. to Queens we are indeed going to not Queens look at all this shit you know what's funniest what the funniest thing is uh, that I don't trust my bike and my bike uh, and my bike is like uh, gonna die in a second. And now I'm at a place where if it does die, I'd have to push it for like fucking two hours. But it's still realistic. Like I could still push my bike from here. You know what I mean? That's what makes it, uh, that's what makes it okay. Sorry, bro. Didn't mean to uh, do all that. My bad. That was a totally illegal move. But it had to be done. So I'm sorry, brother. Can't help you. Can't help you with your question. And if I did by accident, maybe. But the, the, the answer is be gentle, be simple. Be easy. Is that bus flashing? I don't see a stop sign. I don't see a stop sign. It's out. Go this way. It's all right. Mm, 
I love that smell. It's like a burnt wood. What is this? Is this McGinnis? Can't be McGinnis. Oh. Look at that. It's all good. Vuitton umbrella as I walk through the rain. No, let's go to the left. You know what I mean? Let's explore that area. If I'm gonna push my bike, I might as well push it uh, through some populated areas and not by myself. We're good. adorable what is this McGinnis McGinnis I'm not exactly sure why my man is so far back but let him let him do his thing let my brother do his thing We're still recording. Fantastic. Fantastic. You know, nothing like a good old fashioned vlog about nothing. I'm feeling better. I'm, I'm glad I did this. Didn't want to have a lift? What? No idea what that even means. Um, there's some sort of a text message going on between my motorcycle friend group. Anyway, longest light ever. That's why I don't usually cross my Guinness, because good bananas. Sweet spaghetti and good bananas. Nugget. What an absolute unit. We'll go straight. It's funny, I can already smell the bike. It's getting warmed up. Look at that Jaguar, that's adorable. That Jag is dope as fuck. Um, the grill is missing, but you don't need the grill to be cool. You know what I mean? That's not what makes the Jag. It's part of it, I guess. It's just the problem with this bike is that there's not enough wind for it to cool down at all for any reason. Take a right, go by Brooklyn Motto. Nice. Yeah, what up, bro?
good smell. So good. So righteous. Thread the needle, as they say. I'll go by Dirty Billy just to take a look, see if you know. It's not the smartest uh, move right now. You know what I mean? Just because it's like rush hour and everybody's freaking out, but I'll, still, I'll, I'll swing by. I'll do a swing through. Thank you. Appreciate it, bro. Forgot how to shift. You gotta slam this baby into gears. Dirty Billy. Highly doubt anybody's here. It's early. I can't hear you. What are you saying? Oh, you want me to pull up loud, closer? Oh no, no, it's not gonna start. Oh my god, it did start. <laughs> you piece of shit. No, cause uh, the battery died, so I fucking uh, taking it around the block so I can charge it. But it did start back up. So it might be uh, charged. What are you doing? You just chilling? This is a uh, Tonky 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 Tony, Mr. Mustard. I'm doing a vlog. vlog. Yeah. Hey, 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 hey! I'm gonna cut that part out. This is a this is a family affair. This is, uh, what was my name? Uh, not Mr. Mr. Mustard. There was another one. What was it? I don't know. From the other video. <laughs> yeah, it was like it was probably something insulting, mildly. Like Steve or something. Oh yeah, Steve. Right. It was like Steve. This is my friend, uh, Steve. Because you didn't want your professional co-workers to know you're taking shortcuts rebuilding your fork. Oh, wait, are you going to be here for a minute? Uh, I've, I've, I've got to go down to Triumph. How soon? So I'm going to be like... Maybe an hour max. Ba you're going to be back in an hour? No, I'm going to be gone in an hour. Oh, okay. All right. Maybe I'll come back, because I'm done with work. Are you coming back? Yeah. Alright, let me meet you at racing. Alright, I'll be back. He's such a bitch when it comes to racing or anything. You don't have any racing IQ. Anything outside of his little... Yo, let me guess, you're gonna fucking... Stop touching my... <laughs> what, what, are you gonna pull out your fucking third place trophy again? Fourth place this time? Like, this guy keeps bragging about his racing trophies. Never been first in his life. You wanted to get on the back and I'll give you a ride? Sure. Nah. Where is it? Alright. Where is it hot? Dude, because my bike is fucking 220 degrees. It's just no, because it's overheating. It's disgusting, right? Why are you? Alright, I'm gonna go park this piece of shit and come back. <laughs> Anyway, that was Uncle T. That was Dirty Billy. Now I'm gonna park this thing and go uh, go back over there. Chill. Thank you for watching as always. Bye bye. <laughs>